Happy birthday, girl. I can't believe it's already a birthday. I know. It's... Man, time just flies. Like, it was just like yesterday. We were like kids, and now we're grown adults. So, I want to do your makeup for your birthday party. Yeah. Um, I brought my own makeup, and you know how people are like, you shouldn't share makeup. Well, guess what? We're best friends, so that don't apply to us. And I know I'm supposed to wait, but I'm going to go ahead and do it anyways. I'm going to give you your birthday presents because that's what best friends do. And, you know, I just, I don't want to wait. I want to surprise you now, you know. So I got you to start off with. I got you this it is it's like a towel you wrap it around and you got this thing that you put on your hair and it also comes with a scrunchie they only had zebra patterns so I got you the zebra pattern one because I know how much you like zebra pattern all right next up I got you a gift set of bath salts since I know how much you love taking a bath. I can't blame you because I love bath time. I would have bought you some bath soap but I know you're picky about your your bubble baths and I can't blame you. I'm real picky myself. I only like certain scents like cucumber, lavender. I like vanilla too and coconut. There's just certain kinds I won't use. Also, it's because my skin is sensitive. And I won't use certain kinds because it'll make my skin break out. But you got Mary Cherry, which is a cherry kind. Got Coconut Snowflake. Got Ginger Frost. And Lavender something I don't know I don't know and last but not least I got you this this is uh it's like a bedtime gift set this comes with bath crystals this comes with this actually does come with bubble bath but it's just a little thing and Something I've never even heard of, but it's called Pillow Mist. I guess what this does is you spray it on your pillow and it makes your pillow smell good. Yeah. You can actually smell it through the box. I didn't even know that. And it also comes with a sleeping mask. Yeah, so. I hope you like it. You know, I just, even though we've been friends for so long, I didn't necessarily know what exactly to get you that you didn't already have so i decided to get you that and i really hope you like it oh thank you i, I did try my best so next thing we got to do your makeup because this is your birthday party and this is going to be one big birthday party like we're going to invite everybody over and you need to look your best which i mean you already look your best but still i just you know best friends and we got to do whatever we can to make each other happy. So I brought my makeup bag. Yeah, I do have a makeup box. I just don't, I didn't bring the whole thing. I just brought what we needed or what we want because you really don't need the makeup. You're beautiful just the way you are. And I got the primer. I brought my travel thing of... Brushes. I got cosmetic sponges. Got the 
bronzer. Got the blush and highlighter. Last but not least, I got some foundation. All right. So, first things first, I'm going to take out some cosmetic sponges. Oh, and I got some makeup wipes just in case it, um, just in case it don't do right and I gotta start over. Okay. Now. Ah, oh, oops, my bad. I'm sorry. Alright, so we are going to start off with some moisturizer. And the good thing about this is it, is, it comes with sunscreen, even though it's January, so you ain't got to really worry about the weather. I mean, it's like 30-something degrees outside right now, maybe 50. I don't know. I haven't checked. All I know is it's pretty cold. So. this all over your face. Okay. Just a little bit more. Gotta have all that nutrients on your face so all the foundation and stuff can stick to it and Hopefully this won't cause your acne to break out. Which you never really had a problem with acne. That was more my problem. So really I should be focused more on my acne than yours. Like I can't even remember the last time I seen you that I seen you with a pimple on your face. It's been a long time. Yes, I notice because I'm your friend and I notice everything. this hydrating primer which is going to go great with that moisturizer this comes with coconut water aloe vera it's silicone and oil free and this lasts for 12 hours It smells really good. Like it really does smell like coconut. That's good. That's like one of my favorite scents. Like, you know, coconut, I I don't like eating coconut by itself. And for the most part, I don't really like eating it with anything else. Now, I'll eat seven layer cookies or like brownies with coconut, but I won't eat no cake with coconut. I don't eat coconut pie. I don't eat anything else that has coconut. But I love, 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 love the smell of coconut. I love coconut lotion. I love coconut hair cream. I love coconut hair perfume. Coconut perfume in general. Like, all that fun stuff. Like, I just love it. Okay. I'm 
use this foundation. I know it's not exactly your skin tone, but it'll be all right. And we may have to apply just a little more primer. We might. So what is your favorite kind of scent? Like, I know we've been best friends for long, but I've never really asked you. Like, I know, like, our scents has changed. Like, a long time ago, I hated the smell of coconut, and now I love it. I kind of like the same with cucumbers. I never thought I would have really liked the smell of cucumbers, but I really do. Oh, that's, that's good. What kind of cake did you buy? Hey, that sounds good. You want to just like order a pizza or something for the party? Or are you going to like order something else like fast food or anything other than pizza? No. Yeah, I'd rather I'd rather just have pizza. So it's it's gonna be like a pizza party with some like diet cokes and some like Pepsi or something like that. Oh, don't forget to bring water. I'm I'm more of a water person. I love diet coke, but I love water more. So don't forget to bring some water. Oh, and I am in charge of the music. Okay. Yeah, I, I like to plan the music. And I got you some decorations put up already, so you ain't got to worry about that. Yeah. This is going to be a real fun party. I think you're going to get, like, a ton of gifts, and you're going to eat and listen to music and just chill out with everybody. Yeah, it's going to be lit. I don't know if people use that word anymore. I don't know. I'm, I've always been like the super uncool friend. But hey, at least I'm loyal. Okay, let's see. I'm going to use a bit more primer. Start off with some bronzer. Uh, I'm using these smaller brushes because you have a really small face. I don't know if you've noticed. you do you have a really small face lucky gotta do your nose do your chin and do your other side there we go. Let's see. Probably going to need a blush brush. For this next one but anyways i'm gonna get some highlighter go ahead and highlight those other those other parts Oh, 
oh yeah, you're already looking good. I mean, you look good no matter what, but you know, it's nice to get dolled up sometimes. I mean, after all, this is your special day and you should be able to do whatever you want on it. And that includes putting on a face full of makeup because just why not? It's always nice to get prettied up sometimes. You know, I'm probably going to go put some on myself just cause. Yeah. Even though I just put on acne, acne cleaning products, I decided that I want to go ahead and put some on myself. But obviously after we're done with you. Okay. You want the uh, shimmering blush or do you want just the classic? Hmm, my phone. Okay, shimmering it is. Okay. All right. We forgot to put concealer. Honestly, you may not even need concealer because you don't have the kind of bags under your eyes like I do. You're just a lot prettier than I am. I don't. It happens. Oh, well, thank you. Yeah, I mean, I'm not good with makeup, but I am good with my hair. I mean, obviously, you know, if you've known me for, since you've known me for a long time, you understand that I don't really do nothing with my hair but put my um, Curl Enhancing Smoothie on it, and that's about it. Okay, let's see what's next. I'm going to go ahead and get started on them eyes. Which, I forgot to get this out, my bad, but mascara. Okay. So, I got you the Champagne Shimmering Eyeshadow. And I'm going to let you decide what kind you'd like to use. Alright, you got pink, you got a gold, you got a dark brown, and then you got a light brown. Which one would you like to use? Pink? Alrighty. Yeah, I can't blame you. Pink is like my favorite color, as you can tell. So, everything's got to be pink you're looking good already yeah I want to add extra detail to your eyes because you know that's where all your features are is your eyes it's either it's always either your eyes or your lips that get the most attention Okay, now I'm going to use this. And this, even though it's a dollar, it's like one of the best uh, mascaras you can you can never get because it's just you know it makes your eyelashes longer and it makes them darker and prettier of course like I said you really don't need them 
I was almost about to put that whole glob on your eyeshadow. I mean, on your eye, uh, eyelashes, my bad. I don't know why I'm stuttering so bad today. Probably because I'm just so excited for your birthday party. Because it's been so long since we've had a birthday party. Yeah, it was like seven years ago since we had a big birthday party. So, I'm really excited for it. Let's see, let's do your lip liner. Got the dark red. Now I'm going to use this. We're doing a nice red because it will match the lip liner. And red is a very sophisticated color. Man, you're looking so good. So pretty. Girl, you are definitely going to be 100% the center of attention tonight. Alright, so, I think that was everything. Double checking before we add the setting spray. Um, right now, I'm going to just brush your eyebrows. slightly because this is a pretty dark um eyebrow pencil so it like it'll make them look really dark if you ain't careful and last but not least we got the setting spray And there you go. You look so good. I can't believe it. Like, you already look pretty without your makeup, but when you got makeup on, you look like role model good. Like, oh my goodness. Like, you are definitely going to have one fantastic party. Oh, you're welcome. Like, you ain't even got to thank me. Like, like I said, we've been friends for so long that you ain't even gotta thank me we've been friends since we were like kids so i already know you're thankful no nah, i don't want to go to cosmetology school i got different plans you know no offense to anybody that does i mean it's a good trade to get especially in this economy i mean in this economy you need any trade you can get so, I think that cosmetology is good. I just want to do something different, you know. 
Like, I mean, I love makeup. I just don't love it enough to do it every day. But kudos to anybody, especially you, who wants to do it. Because it's definitely something anybody should consider doing. Because like I said, in this economy, you really don't want to spend the rest of your life doing like cashiering and retail. Trust me, I've worked. I've already worked in retail and fast food. It's just not the way to go. I mean, it's good to get you through a trade school, but it's not good enough to really make a living off of like you'd rather do something like anything really like you can do cosmetology you can do nail technician you can um what was it you can do tattoos you could work as a mechanic you could paint houses uh you could do home improvement just anything like there is literally a job for everything in this world and it's always good to get a trade like you ain't got to necessarily go to college and spend four four to eight years doing something that you don't know if you're really going to want to do for the rest of your life like for me that would be the biggest problem with going to college like the biggest fear of mine going to college is spending years studying for something and then not wanting to do it afterwards. That's my biggest fear. So I'd say always start off small. Because like I said, if you if you like start off small, then at least you didn't waste your entire life doing something that you later didn't want to do. But hey, I mean, my grandma, she spent half of her life doing hair and then spent 10 years working in an Alzheimer's clinic so really I mean there's all things you could do like my aunt she spent the first half of her life for like 10 years of her life working as a nurse and then she decided to work in the oil industry afterwards so you really don't know where life is going to take you because I mean, life is complicated. Like, some people start off wanting to do one thing, and then they switch to another. And, you know, some people, they get lucky, and they find something, and they do it forever. So, you really don't know until you really get out there and do it. But, I'm your best friend, so I'll support you no matter what. Like, it don't matter what you decide to do. You can do... uh makeup you can do teaching you can be an astronaut you can be a mail carrier oh did you know that you can make eighty thousand dollars a year just by sorting mail no no you gotta look it up you gotta look it up i mean it like you can literally make eighty thousand dollars you can make more than some nurses out there just by sorting mail i know like it's mind-blowing but i have faith in you and I know we got to talking about careers and jobs and all that, but, you know, I mean, this is your birthday. Let's not stress you out. We got, we got a whole year to think about what we're going to do. Actually, not really a whole year, more like, more like four months. But anyways, you know, it's, we can always take a break from school and think about just whatever, anything else but schools and trade. Actually, I recommend just taking a year off, figuring out what you really want to do. I thought I had something stuck on me. Anyways, all right, girl. I got to do my makeup real quick, and I will meet you downstairs, and we got to get this party started because I know that that cake is an ice cream cake. It is going to melt. The drugs are going to get hot, and we can't have that. So, girl, I will be right, I'll be right with you, okay? So you, you got to get down there and you got to get this party started.